What's up, YouTube? This is uh, Zigtech uh, with a review uh, iPad 2 connected to the uh, Oxium uh, 49 MIDI keyboard uh, via connection uh, camera kit for the uh, iPad or iPad 2, if you will. Um, I'm actually I actually have this hooked up to a to a uh, USB hub. It's a uh, four bus USB hub. Um, it's not powered. But somehow the USB works with the Oxium 49. The USB hub works with the Oxium 49. I, I think the USB hub, it actually gives it a little bit of uh, more power, uh, you know, because uh, if you try to hook it up regularly through just through the iPad, it's, just, it's going to say, it's going to give you that dumb message that, it, that pops up, uh, you know, this device is uh, too much power for the iPad 2. So I'm just going to log in here real quick. I don't want you guys to see my passcode. Alright. Alright, so we're going to load up GarageBand. Uh, forgive me for the sound. Don't have this hooked up to my surround speakers or anything like that. Just wanted to give you guys a quick review on um, how you can use your MIDI keyboard for GarageBand on the iPad 2. Uh, let's just open up any song. Just, just going to give you guys a quick review. Uh, let's go to keyboards. Okay, and everything set. Everything works. can actually see uh, by the uh, volume control that you know it has MIDI signal coming in. So that's all for now. Um, I'm going to give you guys a, uh, the next review. Just keep looking um, on uh, microphone tutorials and everything like that that you can hook up to your garage band on your iPad too. Um, it's pretty neat. You know the the touchpad is awesome, but you know, I actually feel the real thing is just like you know, I can really make my beats, make my music, you know. So, Zig Tech, I'm out of here, guys.